Uh, this is this was shocking to us. We weren't ready for what happened. Um, I received a phone call about eight, seven forty-five this morning. That was the first news I got of it. I was driving into work, and um, you know, it's one of those where you just want to turn around and go back home and get back into bed and hope you can wake up and start over again. But um, but that being said, um, they told us it was temporary. Uh, they, there was no indication that this was a permanent thing. We went through this in 2008. I, I guess the biggest impact were retail sales, uh, sales tax. But those were what hurt us the most because 39% of those workers live in Granite, but 61% leave every day and then they come back every day. And as they're either leaving or coming, they're shopping at our grocery stores, they're um, stopping at our convenience stores, going to the Walmarts and the Kmarts of the world. Um, so, I mean, th that the impact will be there. Those guys are no longer going to be coming in, buying their food to take into lunch or buying their coffee and soda and gas. We're very hopeful as a business community always that things will change and change quickly. Um, our prayers go out to all the families of the workers and um, the leaders in the facility here in Granite City. Um, our business groups are together and we're working and there's a lot of good momentum going on down here in Granite City now. A lot of rebirth going on so we're hopeful that that will pick up where any layoffs would or temporary um, lack of work would um, affect our community. So we're trying to come together as a community and be strong. Uh, the um, you know, the oil prices the way they are that's what's affecting our plant. You know, okay. So uh, people get uh, I guess cheaper gas is a good thing for everybody else but then that, that hurts our industry. Right. And then, uh, just with some of the ring I've done, the, um, the steel imports have really hurt us too. This uh, last year, I said it went up 68 percent. So, and I think it's making up about a third of the market the steel imports. Well, it's a contract year, yeah. So, right. you know, you, I'm not surprised by anything they will pull on the contract year. What's causing this? Do you think? I don't. I can't really say. Uh, it can be a multitude of things that. You know, U.S. Steel, uh, you know, the government is letting the cheap steel come through. If, if this is short term, I don't know that it will impact us greatly. Um, it didn't last time. Um, you know, this, that was a six month deal last time. I'm hoping it won't be near as long. And we think we can recover from that. I'm, a, I'm an optimistic person. And um, I have my fingers crossed that this is going to be short term and that hopefully the impact to these workers is very short-lived